and the crowd goes wild. Oh, Tebow takes the bait. Oh, and 40 yard dash. Hello, Hello family. The Broncos sure How was your day? Defense Good. Good. The Vikings Almost suck. Go Vikings What's for dinner, Broncos sweetheart? Let's see. Uh oh. Well, looky here. I guess Chloe can eat her casserole that I so graciously salvaged for her. <clears throat> and for the rest of us, I'll whip up some icy dice rolls. Yes! What do you think Clementine will want to drink? I don't know. Well, go ask her, please, Chloe. I, uh, I, I can't. How come? Anyone? Sh uh, we split up at the gas station. She'll be home pretty soon. I think she wanted to go shopping. She's all alone? Apparently so. Cameron Costa, was this really a wise decision? It's okay, Mom. She's 21. She's mature. Do you not remember her last visit to Walmart? Well, yes, I do, but we'll try and call her, please. She left her phone here. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. She insisted that I go. She said that she would catch up. Where did you go to? She met up with me at Elix Reservoir. I took a walk, too. Did you? Well, at least you didn't toss my casserole for nothing. Why are you getting caught up in Cameron's lies, Chloe? Shh! I don't want to look like a lunatic talking to thin air. Too late. Honey, have you been feeling okay? Um, yes. Why? I don't know. I guess you just... You've been acting a little strange lately. Yeah. Have you been feeling any odd feelings lately? Like, sad at a happy moment? Or happy at a sad moment? No, Mom. A wanting around the opposite gender? No, Mom. Depression? No, I am fine, Mother. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. Well, be assured that I am just dandy. All right, if you're positive, I am. Cameron, would you please set the table? Mom, why me? I did it last night. You left Clementine. Fine, but keep in mind that your other daughter did not eat your casserole. Excuse me, Mrs. Trouble, but don't forget that I just saved your tail. Yeah, yeah, sorry. I found you! Ah, I'm home! Ah. There you are, Clementine. Ah, I was so lost. How is shopping? Shopping? Ah, I wish! Excuse me? We were at the gas station, and I was picking out a soda, and I turned around and poof! She was gone! I was under the impression that you two split up, so you could go shopping. What do you have to say for yourself, Cameron? This is insane! I told you that I was going to go check out, and then we could go to Elix Reservoir. And you told me to go without you because you wanted to go shopping. Don't you remember? I don't remember this. I told you how to get home. When? Oh, my dog! Gosh, I must be delusional. I have short-term memory loss. Something! How come I don't remember anything? I'm crazy! I'm a psychopath! Oh, Lord. I'm blind! I'm blind! Don't go towards the light, Clementine. Don't go towards the light. Calm down, Clem. You're here. You're safe. That's all that matters. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. I'm here. I'm safe. I'm here. I'm safe. Come upstairs. Let's get you cleaned up and changed. <sighs> okay. You can take a shower, get in your PJs, and I'll wash those clothes for you. How does that sound, sweetie? Your cousin, girlies. I am very concerned for her. I'm honestly impressed that she made it to college. Dad, she's smart. I'm not saying that she's not. I personally just can't believe that she didn't get hit by a car or end up working at McDonald's. Or jumped off a cliff thinking she was a ninja. Or that... I love how our family time consists of us making fun of our crazy cousin. 
He's going to be one of those crazy women in the nursing homes who's in the wheelchairs and thinks that they're a famous NBA player and that the bingo room is the Bahamas. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> She's upstairs showering. What's so funny? <laughs> it was nothing, Mother. Howie? Oh, it was nothing, sweetheart. Why don't we get ready for dinner? Actually, I was thinking that maybe we should go out for dinner. We haven't in a while, and we have a guest. Sure, where to? I don't know. Any ideas? How about Sunshore? You mean the club? Sure, Clum loves it there, and the food's good, and plus, it's supposed to be really nice out tonight. No. Yeah, honey, I don't know. I was thinking something more fancy, like Bamboo Garden. Clem's a college student. She eats noodles all the time. Who said Chinese has to be noodles? Listen, all I'm saying is that we're doing this for Clem. Why not give her a treat? I get where you're going. She feels stupid. I kind of screwed up her day. And the last time she was there, Chloe half scared her to death. Good point. Hey, Chloe, your thoughts? No. How come? I just... I just think that the rock top diner would be better. Lots of skylights, formal, cheap, good service, good food, total package. And it's new. I agree with Chloe. Me too. What? We'll go to the Sun Shore some other time, okay? I think we all need to cool down and eat a good meal. Agreed. And don't think for a second that this gets you out of eating your casserole, Missy. Dang it. I'll go see if Clem is ready, and then we'll go. Go get in the car, please. Mm -mm. Good call, Clover. This is delicious. And it makes my wallet smile. Yes, it's very nice. Need anything over here? No? Great bye. Except for him. Gosh, grouchy. But that's alright. I'm having a great time. This is wonderful. Not as wonderful as Sunshore would have been. Grow up, Cameron. Grow up, Chloe. Both of you. Get a grip, please. Don't ruin this night. Yeah, Cameron, don't ruin the night. Chloe? Ugh. Behave, Chloe. Don't act like this. Go away. Hey, not nice. Oh, sorry, not you. What was that all about? Uh, nothing. Random spasm brain thing. Right. Yep. Here's your check. Your service was a pleasure. Thanks for seeing us here at Rock Top Diner. Have a good evening. Please come again. Isn't he just a bundle of joy? A delight. Well, family, should we head home now? Yep, I'm beat. Bedtime for Pops. Clem, would you like to watch a movie? Oh, no, thank you, Aunt Marley. I need some sleep. I had a hectic day. Alrighty. Say goodnight, girls. Goodnight, Clementine. I'm glad you're back. See you tomorrow. Goodnight, girls. Alright, go upstairs and get ready for bed. I don't need you to sleep right away, but I do need you down by ten. Fine. Sure thing, Mom. Good night. Oh, oh, crap nuggets. Don't talk like that. I tripped. I can talk however I want. I didn't say anything. No, sorry. Not you. Then who? No one. Just myself. Dad was right. You are acting strange. Are you sure you're okay? Yes, I'm sure. Okay, okay. Sorry, Moody Trudy. Uh, where's the laptop? Shoot. Uh, it's somewhere. Let's just go to bed. Phew, you're back to your old self again. Nighty night while it's still light. Ha ha, so funny. I try. Good night. Yeah, it's still really light out. Yeah, but I'm tired. Me too. That whole Clementine thing really tired me out. You were pretty convincing. I have to be. Good night. Love ya. Good night. I 
I can't sleep. I know, and I'm so tired. So mad. My head hurts. Mine too. Stop it, Camry. Why should I? You destroyed my afternoon. You are so lucky that I made this conversation inaudible to those two. And what were you going to do with that money anyway? I mean, we're consciences. You don't just mosey around in Target or stop by at Walgreens. What do you know? You've always been cooped up inside of your pathetic little holder. You know nothing about being absent like this. You're goody two paws. Just stop! Let them at least get a wink, a couple of Z's. They're feeling my wrath. They're ruining the day. Nice line, Neville. Shut up, Carly Shay. You are such a dork. You know, Cleo, I heard talking to yourself is unhealthy. Ugh, that's it. I am getting some NyQuil. Get me some too. Cleo? Yes, Chloe? What's going on? How come we can't sleep? It's Camry. I made her mad. And now she's making us, quote, rue the day. She quoted Neville Packerman from iCarly. Lame. Take some medicine. It blocks off all conscience activity. I can't get upset and make you upset too. Sure thing. What did you do to her? I would honestly rather not speak of it in her company. Whoa, whoa, whoa. She's here? In this room? Yeah. How do you think she was making you rue? That's so creepy. Where is she? Can I touch her? Am I hot? Cold? You are ridiculous. Come on, tell me. Sisters are creepers.